Hi everybody, it's the Red Road Homestead, and I gotta show you something. Here's the other two bunnies that was born to mommy and daddy, but if you look way over there, there's two more little bunnies, and one is orange. And look in here, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got more baby bunnies. Look at it. that one's orange too. I can't believe it. What am I gonna do with all these bunnies? Oh my God. Plus I got five baby bunnies that's already growing in the other cage. And the two baby bunnies that was down here, which made seven. And now I have nine more baby bunnies. I was hoping the babies would get over here closer, but they're way over there. Now you might be able to see them. But one's orange and one's white down there. Yep. <laughs> we are bunny happy. <laughs> the other bunnies are over there. I'll give you a look at them, how big they've gotten. Uh, I think I'm running a bunny farm. So, yeehaw. Here's how big the other bunnies have got. There's mama. And here is the babies. But it's so cute. Now I've got an orange bunny. Couple of them. I've never seen an orange bunny. I'm all excited, you guys. <laughs> and furthermore, let me see if I get a better shot of the baby ones. There, see how tiny? And that one's orange. It looks white on the camera, but it's orange. No wonder they've been eating so much. <laughs> I gotta get in there and, well, it's gonna be hard cleaning that cage with all of them in there and catching them. But then I got this little story I was gonna tell you about. And when this land, when we first moved here, I don't know if all of you can remember, but all of this and all back there to the woods, I passed the woods now, but. And all out here was tall wheat. There was nothing here. My son, Little Wolf, and Running Wolf, his oldest son, built something. And I just brought it back home. We loaned it to some friends of ours. And I decided that it needed to join its place in my garden. So, I'm going to go show you what it is. Because I couldn't let it go. It was the first thing on this property, even before my cabin, the chicken coops, or anything. It was built by, like I said, Little Wolf and Running Wolf. And they brought it down here. They put it back by the woods. Then we loaned it to some friends. And... I decided it had to come home because it was the first thing on our land. Now you might get a chuckle out of this one. I got to trim the hole in it. But right here it is. And you see that flower pot that's on top of it. I'm actually going to plant flowers there. But this was put back in the woods. And uh, see this part here that's sticking up? They put that there for a toilet paper roll. Let me move this so you can see. This is called, except for the cats in there now, this was named a Tennessee pooper. <laughs> I just had to share it with you all. So, yep, Tennessee pooper is getting put to use. I am going to be trimming that hole so I can set the flower pot down in it so that we can have flowers and the bees to come help pollinate. And there you go. There's our little story of what was first on this land, the Tennessee pooper. Y'all have a good day. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget my giveaway on April 4th at 1 p.m. Be there or be square. Bye for now.